All right, so let's uh, let's close that menu and get out of here. Where do I have to go now? Unfortunately, it doesn't look like there's anything else I can interact with in here. And Anya's is like gone, at least for now. Um, all right, so I have to go. I'm gonna. It looks like this is gonna be the door that I was questioning earlier. Yeah, there's a blue spot on the uh, on the floor there right now. Very nice. So I actually can come out here now. Um, did it? It would have been nice if they put a notice that said, like, this door is locked or something earlier. But they didn't, and it's time to move on. Anyas! Where the skitty are you? Alright, so this is another dungeon. Uh, this looks like part of the same one, a continuation of the same one. It has the same recommended level and everything. Um, where do I even go? Because I saw several branching paths, and no indication as to which one I'm supposed to take. That is a dead end. Or it's not a dead end, but it has a platform that's on... Um, in the air right now, so I can't really go there. Uh, this one maybe? Oh god, there are three of them. This one goes up. I'm gonna take this one. And... Does this just go- okay, so this is a staircase. And if I want to get back, I'm gonna have to take this one down. I see, I see, I see. So that was- what, what did I even pick up? Something wine? That wine that I keep seeing scattered around the game that I never read the description of. Um, I'm looking at the, the I'm looking at the map on the bottom screen, and trying to figure out does this go anywhere? I think the other one might not go anywhere, and I might want to take that instead. But oh come on! Oh wait, there's more here. Uh, I was gonna say I thought I could cross over to that chest, but apparently not. Yeah, this goes to the stairs, this goes to the end, and um, I'm going to want to take the other one. So let's go back down, take this uh, elevator. This is fun. I'm pretty sure I, uh, I commented on that multiple times in previous videos where I was wandering around in this dungeon, but I'll do it again anyway. This is fun. Um, the, I've said this many times as well, but the... Uh, like, multiple dimensions going up and down and stuff. Hello, Earth Mallet. Uh, they really make these dungeons much more interesting to explore than the rather linear ones in, um, in Bravely Default. And there were some things like door puzzles and stuff in Bravely Default, but uh, which one do I need? I need this one. Like, when you're playing with the Z-axis, when you're playing with multiple layers, it's uh, much more interesting. So I can go up... And this will lead me to the staircase that goes onwards. There are still three treasure chests. And I see two of them, and I think I can guess where the third one is. It's right below the one. It's it's in between them, really. But I'll have to come back later to get them. Um, let's see. I see those glowing spots on what I assume are windows. And I keep thinking that they're items that I can pick up. Because they're kind of the same color-ish. 4,000 pigs. And they're not. And I get disappointed every time I see them, even though I should know what they are by now. Um, up these stairs. An elevator. I'm not gonna mess with that elevator right now. Teleport stone. I have... I want to say I have like seven or eight of them right now. But I guess if I want to go back to the beginning for whatever reason, it's good to have those on hand. Um, this way. This will go down. And I saw the other dead end uh, on the bottom of the map. Was uh, It was another elevator. At least it's shaped like an elevator on the bottom screen. Um, kind of an octagon sort of shape. See, that doesn't go anywhere. No. Stairs. It is kind of hard, admittedly, when one part of the map goes underneath another part. Um, it does kind of go 50% transparent, but it's, um, still a little bit confusing if you're not, like, mentally prepared for it, I suppose. Uh, I'm pretty sure I should just leave this alone for now, but, um, yeah, I'm just gonna leave that alone for now. I just have to go and, uh, examine it anyway. Let's see... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, never mind. Um, I thought I missed something, but I don't think I did. Now, does this, this goes back down, doesn't it? I think that goes back down. Hmm. There's a bunch of, like, crisscrossy stairways here. That's an, en that's an entrance, exit, whatever. This is a chest, Artemis bow. All right, that sounds fun. I'll check that later. Uh, I wanted to say that was one of the better, if not best, bows from Bravely Default. And you could uh, assign it to the Hunter or Ranger or whatever it was. Not sure though. Hermes Sandals. That sounds like something for uh, speed, 
or agility or whatever you want to call it. And now let's go down. I think now let's go down. This is uh this is confusing. Like I said, it's fun, but it's easy to get lost. Well, it's not easy to get lost. It's um It's kind of hard to see where you have to go, I suppose. I was here earlier, wasn't I? I'm pretty sure I was here earlier. All right, and this is back to um this is back to where I was before. So maybe I do have to go up here. Come on, hit the lever. It's uh it's definitely almost impossible to see on the bottom screen where you have to go. Um did I miss something earlier? I don't think I missed anything earlier. All right, I guess I just have to come back later then. Uh, I'm gonna go and take the staircase. And here we are. That was a very long walk for a relatively small like surface area map. But anyway, <clears throat> what is this? This is a uh, floor one F, and this is just a treasure chest. So apparently I'm missing something earlier. Um, that is a Gladys, or otherwise known as just like a Roman sword. Okay. So where do I have to go then? I must have missed something. It was probably something very obvious too. That is not it. I don't think this is the way just back to where I came. What about this? No, I can't I can't even go there. That I've already uh, explored. That is not it. So I have to go back this way then, down this lift. So this entire section of the map I can rule out as anywhere that's important. Um, hmm. I kind of want to just study the bottom screen for a bit, but I also don't want to do that because then I'll have to do a really awkward cut and editing and stuff like that, which is never fun. Yeah, this I can I can just rule out this part of the map too. Um, there's somewhere to go. Have I been here before? I haven't been here before. All right, this is a chest containing a remedy. I feel like I know remedies are good items, but I feel like the items that you find. In this, ooh, look, this looks important. What's over here? I feel like the items that you find in the chest in this part of the game should be like better than um just a remedy because it's pretty late in the game. I assume we're getting uh towards the climax. This is Pantheon's Wrath. All right, so that is a good lightning type move. I mean, uh, item. So I want to say it's got like base two thousand damage or something like that. Something in that of that magnitude. And this is stairs. Alright, so I missed a whole, like, section of the map earlier when I was just running around. Uh, there is an exclamation point. And... It looks like, okay, the game is just gonna take over for me. Alright, everyone. This is it. We have to stop the Kaiser before he reaches the Holy Pillar. Let's do it! Not gonna happen. Jam! Jan, you're alive! And why shouldn't I be? You never killed me. You get it now? I'll keep coming back as many times as it takes. It's time to put up or shut Yes, yes, yes. I think you established this you a long time ago now. To stop me. The question is, do you have it in you? <sighs> All right, Jen. If that's what you really want, then come and get it. That's more like it. Finally, you got some drive of your own. This isn't for any Kaiser or Pope, Empire or Orthodoxy. This is between me and you. Let's settle this. 